Well, hello, YouTube. It's the Big Brian Shrimper. And what we're looking at now is a whole bunch of brine shrimp. All kinds of different sizes. They look very healthy. Swimming around. Little brine shrimp. There's some medium brine shrimp. And there's some big brine shrimp. Interesting thing about the tank that I got them in here, this is uh, nothing more than an iced tea uh, dispenser. When you might see it, uh, I don't know, like a, a wedding or something with an iced tea in it. I thought I'd convert it over to a, a brown shrimpery and it's working out great. We've had this tank up for, I don't know, about uh, two or three months now and we're probably on our third generation of brown shrimp. Uh, I thought I'd check the water quality today, so I got out my API test kit, and let's look at the results. First thing I looked at is I looked at the uh, nitrates. Uh-oh. That's no good. Nitrates. Perfect. Zero nitrates. That's good. I knocked over my nitrite, but here's the nitrite test, and uh, it's also good. Blue, zero PPMs. So there's no nitrites. Then I check my ammonia and oh lordy lord, look at that. We got ammonia levels off the chart. I mean, we're talking about over the 5.0 PPM. This is something that uh, any old regular fish wouldn't have made it by now in a tank like this. But you look at these brown shrimp, they're not having any problem at all. You might as well think there's zero ammonia in the tank. All right, YouTube, I'm going to sign out. Next episode, we're going to talk about getting that ammonia level down. So until next time, this is the Big Brian Shrimper signing out.